is Tom Jones. Welcome everyone to the last show of CCW on SmackDown vs. Raw 2010. We have so much action for you here tonight. So many contests. The Divas are in action. All your favorite CCW stars. It's time to say goodbye to 2010 in the SmackDown term, of course. Let's take you to the ring. Well... Thank you all so much. First, let me just start off by saying what a wonderful year the CCW has had. And just want to thank all of our subscribers, all of our friends on YouTube, all of our continued supporters. Uh, I need to thank Dolby Blue Star, of course, just for everything. Thank you so much. And um, just you, the great YouTube fans, our subscribers, 162, 162 subscribers at over a quarter of a million views thank you so much for all of your valued support this is the last show on smackdown vs. raw 2010 of course ccw will return with the draft with general managers with twist turns and everything in between so please stay tuned tonight we will announce one of the three general managers for our upcoming season but right now i give you our opening contest as introduced by well someone very very special
the obvious choice was who Shawn Michaels was going to go for. The last CCW show on 2010 just wouldn't be right without the game. Triple H making his way to the ring. Triple H, the best friend of Shawn Michaels, the man who was retired by his opponent here tonight, the Phenom, The Undertaker. And you've got to believe that Triple H wants to rectify his best friend's loss and cap off the last match on this rendition of SmackDown vs. Raw the right way. Geico really save you 15% or more on car insurance. Does Johnny Blaze not have a cool fucking entrance? Who doesn't want you to wrestle? Who doesn't want you to fight? Who wants to know if you're ready to play? Roll a ball! The Ghost Rider! Johnny Blaze! Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. CCW. It's better here. There is no entrance like The Undertaker's. The same can be said about Shawn Michaels' entrance. However, thanks to The Undertaker, up until tonight, we were never going to see it again. The Phenom, the greatest creation professional wrestling has ever produced makes his way to the ring for tonight. Will the bell toll for Triple H? See the shoulder of the game peering over to the Phenom. Well, here it is the opening contest of CCW Curtain Call. It's the game taking on the dead man. Off to a back and forth start. The Undertaker now with right hands. Triple H countering. The game again counters. Taker with another right hand. And another. A third one. Not connecting. Off the ropes now. Triple H with the duck. Hits the neck breaker on the Undertaker. And 
there's the Larry. Taker now, bumping the cover. Too early by the dead man. There's the boot. Triple H out working on the dead man's arm. Right hand. Kick to the midsection now by Triple H. And a hard chop by the game. Taker rolls out. Close line. Turning the dead man over. But Triple H brings him back in. Triple H knows what this match means, not just to him, not just to The Undertaker, but to Shawn Michaels. This might even rectify whatever wounds Michaels is feeling from his career being ended by The Undertaker. Triple H now pulls off in the back of the head. Shoots the half. I'll take her now. Trying to get Triple H up. Last ride, perhaps. Triple H fighting it. Whoa! Triple H pulled out the power bomb. Knee to the midsection. Right hand. Big strikes by the Undertaker. Uh-oh, you know what this is, old school. Taker going up. And he hits him. The Undertaker now with a tombstone. This may be in one, two, Triple H kicked out. The Undertaker now stepping back up. The dead man is motioning, saying it's time, it's over. Wait, what's this? From behind, sweet chin music. Shawn Michaels has interfered in this match. The game loads the Undertaker up. Drops the pedigree. All oh, the cover, you know it's over. One. Two, three. Well, Shawn Michaels got his wish. He got to kick the Undertaker's head off. Oh, what a DX reunion, if you will, on the last show. Folks, stay tuned. More action to come.